your house is a location where you can be comfortable as possible as you can so when you are planning your home's interiors to do so in a way that's comfy for you don't try to do everything at once instead take one step at a time the most typical difficulty with the interior design process is determining where to begin then there's the issue of home interior design understanding the space and the needs of each area is the first stage in the interior design process there are a few questions to which you should ask and you should be able to respond to begin how many people will be staying in the house what exactly is the point of designing what is the cognitive process that led to this conclusion there are important issues to consider the next step is to create a budget for your home's interior design you don't have to spend a fortune on your home's interior design separately divide your budget for each room and your kitchen it will be determined by a number of elements including the room size type of furniture furnishing and accessories if you are in a pinch however you can always go with a simple emi option this is the most important step in the interior design process the creative thought process and interior architecture are combined in design creation the most important aspect of design process is space planning a visual design or a design plan of your room will be provided by interior designers this will assist you in comprehending the room's function and proportion once the procedure starts the pictures will become reality the next step is to lay out all of the electrical outlets and light fixtures it will also comprise the installation of pipes and pipelines before you start painting or putting up wallpaper you will need to figure out where the electrical outlets are when it comes to planning the inside of your home lighting is really important factor a wall ceiling is normally 1 foot lower than the actual ceiling this wall ceiling is where the electrical ducts and points are installed it has become an important features of modern home design it not only hides the room's fundamental infrastructure such as plumbing pipes and electrical wiring but it also adds to the design process selecting the appropriate flooring can be a time consuming process as you arrange the interiors gather some information about the various varieties of flooring hardwood laminates tiles and vinyl are all options the decision is based on the cost location and benefits and drawbacks of each alternative for instance while choosing bathroom flooring you should consider whether the material would make the room or floor slippery or not if you are having your furniture designed you will need to know a little about woodworking and different type of material before you acquire something consider what will be used for and how much space it will take up both use and beauty are intertwined if you have a small living room choose furniture that has plenty of storage the most exciting aspect of the process is picking a color for your walls choose colors that complement the lighting and furniture if you want to give your walls a textured look learn about the variation paint finish for each space you can select different kind of accessories using colorful decorations in your living room and bedroom will emphasize the design of the space the utilization of varied textures will bring in pleasure and joy for your bathroom select the faucets and other plumbing fixtures well in advance after you have your interior plan ready the real work begin after that installation process follows in this step of procedures all the elements and appliances decided upon are installed and worked upon finally it comes down to the finishing of the design you must maintain an eye on the completing of the task done check on the polish of the woodwork the finish of the paint and the furnishings the strength of cabinet handles and the corner finishing of each room should also be checked very well as we know that our house is a beautiful place where we spend our most of time so it should be a comfortable and a pleasing place for us so when you are planning your home interior designs you have to consider couple of things that have been described in this video you have to understand the space and the need of each area first before designing the interior process you have to also utilize and estimate the budget that you have for your interior design 